Today on Max Handy Gadgets, we're going to be looking at this Modern Innovations Universal Lid Set. It's a set of two, so it comes with a, it fits like 7 inch all the way to 12 inch, so we're going to unbox this and see what's in the box. So let's get started. Alright, let's open the box. See what's in there. Alright, looks like we have two lids and some instructions. Let's see. Yep. Alright. Oh, there's more stuff in here. Looks like we have looks like a, a lid knob or a handle. And there's another one. So we got two handles. They seem to be silicone so they won't get burned, so that's good. Alright, we'll put them on there and we'll give them a shot and see how they fit the other pans that we have here. That, that's usually the problem. You can't quite get the pans to fit the lids, or the lids to fit the pans. So let's get started. Okay, let's see if it tells you how to put these knobs on here, these handles. Uh, it just seems like it has a screw on the bottom and I guess we'll figure it out. It don't really tell you much. It just tells you the sizes. I don't know if you can see that, but it's got the sizes there of the different uh, offsets and the rings or whatever you want to call them. And uh, yeah, it looks like it should fit like a variety of pans. We're going to check that out today too. Alright, let's get rid of that. And we'll get rid of our knobs. And we'll see if we can get this little one out of here. It's in bubble wrap, so that's good. Yeah, it looks like it's a nice glass lid with a little vent hole. And the underside, it does have the, the ridges or the offsets, so it'll fit in each pan or on top of it. It'll probably work good. This is silicone. It bends a little, very little, and uh, the insert's glass. So that's good. All right, that's that one. Let's get the other one out. Let's see how the big one is. Okay, the big one is pretty big. And it's the same setup. It has those ridges around the edge there that sits down in the pan. Makes a good seal. And it is silicone right about an inch from the edge. Yeah. All right, and it's got a vent hole. So let's just see how big that really is to the outer edge of the silicon ring. It seems to be almost 12 and a quarter inches. Yep, all right. Let's flip that over for a second. I just want to see. The inner ring of that is 11 and 3 quarters to the inner part of that ring there, right there. So it looks like it'll do pretty good here. So let's see if we can put these knobs on here, the old handles. Get the bag open, here we go. That. Now these are silicone. They're nice. They fit right on top there. Yep, okay. Now it looks like it comes already uh, on the screw. And it is stainless steel screw. And it's got a little insert, I guess, so it'll go through the bottom of the lid. And it won't crack the glass. Yep, that's what it's doing. It sits right in there. Alright, let's screw that on. See if we can get it up in there. And just about got it started. Okay. It started. Okay, now let's get our little screwdriver set we have. These come in handy. You know, you pick out what size you need. You pick out, well, there you go. 
and we'll pick a Phillips and see how that works. This is a magnetic holder, so slips right in, and it's also ratcheting, so you can ratchet if you want to. But let's see if we can tighten this up. Oh yeah, it's going, going real good. Tighten that right up nice and snug. There you go, not over tight, you know, just snug them up good. And that's a nice handle. Very good, let's do the other one. Get the other one out of the bag here. Yeah, they're both the same size, so we're good. We get the little screw out, stainless steel washer and little screw. And we'll do the same thing to this one. Put the screw through. Make sure the plastic washer is on the underside. Get it started. And we'll tighten her up. Snug him up good. Okay, that's it. Looks good so far. All right, let's see what kind of pans they fit. Yeah, first off, let's get our our large cast iron skillet here, that 12 inch. And I have a glass lid for it, but in case you don't have one, let's see if that big one fits on there. Okay, let's give it a shot. Oh, nice. Right on there. Fits right around that edge. Fits right on there. Can you see it? See the pour spout right there? It lets the air out too. You don't need to let it out because we have a vent in the, in the lid though. You have other pans without a pour spout. This will vent it. That's good. Okay, it fits that one. Let's check another one. Alright, let's check our our 8 inch. This is an 8 inch lodge and I have a lid for it but in case you don't have your uh, a lid for your 8 inch cast iron lodge let's see fits right in there I see it that's nice well there you go that's two for two fits right in there you can see it, it's in there good alright so it fits the lodge 8 inch now this one's a bit tri tricky, this uh, copper one. Now it's really, I have a problem with this. The outside edge is nine and five eighths. Inside is eight and five eighths. See, that's pretty small. So let's see if the little one fits in there. That'd be great. It did fit right in there well that's good see that it went right in there on that lip perfect so that's three for three so far that's pretty good all right let's try another one now here's a pan here that's a little bigger than the copper one we just showed you so let's check out how big the nine and three quarters but inside it's nine and a half so let's give that a shot. See how that lid fits. Here comes a little one. Fit right in. That's really good. I, it's actually in there, in the groove. You see it? Worked good. So that's, what's that, four pans so far? Yeah, okay. Let's try, let's see. What else we got? No. Nope. So that's four pans so far. They fit all the oddball pans. So you get the big ones. And the uh, I wonder if this would actually fit the, the Instant Pot in case you don't have a glass lid. I'll be right back. Okay, let's see if that big one will fit this Instant Pot. You ready? Here we go.
it sits on the outside lip. Okay, it just doesn't go quite down inside, but it will cover it, but it sits on the outside lip. Now this is an eight quart pot, so if you have a six and a half, this would probably work, go right down inside. Yeah, all right, well it worked, but not as good as the, uh, the original lid for it. I'll show you that. Yeah, here's the, the Instant Pot lid that you can buy. And that does fit in there. And it's all stainless steel. Got a stainless steel handle. Fits right in there just like, you know, any other pot would. And you can use this pot right on the stove because it has a really a thick bottom. Real thick bottom. You can see that. Look how thick that bottom is. Right there. It's, it's thick. And it's all stainless steel. And it's got something inside there to transfer the heat good. But yeah, this lid comes in handy in case you do an Instant Pot pot roast or whatever. You can just carry that to the neighbors. You know, or outside, or wherever you're going. That's, that's really handy, this lid here. Okay. All right, we'll set this aside. And we'll bring back the lids that we just bought. So these are gonna come in handy. Universal lids. I don't think you can beat them. They actually work really well with all these pots and pans. That's really good. So it's a Modern Innovations, Modern Innovations Universal Lid Set. This is the set. I'll put a link in the description for the set. And, you know, if you have use for them, they really come in handy. I know I'm going to use them. Okay, there you have it, guys. An unboxing of the Universal Lid from Modern Innovations. Yep, I did have a cup of coffee sitting here, you know. There must be, you know, somebody taking these coffee cups from me or something. But I'll find it. I'm going to find this one. That does sound normal around here. <laughs>